Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu. Today, our topic is the technology and society of the future. The 21st century is the century of sophisticated technology and science. Technology and science begin to make progress in the 17th century. Since then, technology and science have been making progress by leaps and bounds. New inventions and discoveries in the numerous fields have brought a revolution in the life of human beings. The benefits got from science and its applications are numerous and probably it is not possible to enumerate these. However, it is be beyond doubt that science has helped a great ideal in developing self-confidence, self-esteem and courage in human beings. Now owing environment, but ha he has the capacity to control and modify it is to suit his needs and environments. Previous people believed in super, super citations and in certain supernatural force for the control of their futures. People also used to believe in magic and fortune telling. By adopting scientific methods, human beings are now more confident to handle their environmental conditions. Human beings no more attribute the weather conditions or disaster to supernatural, bad or evil forces. They think independently, logically and scientifically. Before the discovery and development of modern medicines, scientific equipments and instruments of surgery, thousands of people used to die of disease. The Great Plague, which started in 542 AD, was responsible for 95 million deaths in 50 years. The Black Death of Fortune Century wiped out on one third of the whole population of the world. The, pandem the pandemic of 1998 to 1918 caused 10 million deaths in India. The influenza pandemic of 1957 killed 8,000 people in the USA only. Millions of people used to die over the battle fields as a result of septic wounds because no antibiotic and antiseptic were available. Now with the discovery of various medicines and revolution in surgery, smallpox is eradicated from the world, malaria is controlled and very few people die of plague, typhoid and cholera. This, the discovery of penicillin by Alexander Fleming in 1927 revolutionized the treatment of the infections and infectious diseases. Some other discoveries has contributed say, as much as the penicillin to the health and welfare of the people worldwide. Engineering and mechanical technologies have been played a vital role in many fields before the inventions of automobiles, aeroplanes, rockets and stream engines. People used to travel on foot or used animals or animal driven carts to travel from one place to another. The speed was terribly slow as compared with date of days travel. Human beings had to tolerate hardships and suffering of olden day travel. So it took Marco Polo, his father and his uncle Matthew Polo three years to reach China from Venice. Many people died during the journey, but at present the means of transportation have squeezed the distance, overcome the force of gravity and made possible the exploration of the outer space. Man has reached the moon and is trying to reach other plan planets. Never was the world so completely integrated or reachable as it is today. Only in a few hours one can fly around the world or travel from one continent to another. Modern networks of roads have really revolutionized the world and the day-to-day -day activities. Communication technology has brought a, ter a tremendous revolution in modern sciences. A few scores years back, it was very difficult for the people of a country to get newsletters, information and knowledge from other countries. A large number of people of the world were living in isolations. Now, owing the efficient media and quick means of communication, all nationals are constantly in close contact with one another. A series of inventions like telegraph, telephones, radio, television, print media, communication, satellite, electronic mails and internet have really converted the world into global village or global apartment. Modern technology is playing a central role in the field of agriculture. It has greatly helped men in developing agriculture, livestock and food industries. It has helped hmm, Men to bring barren and arid lands under the plough. It has played a man to construct dams for irrigation and generation of electricity. It has enabled the agriculturists to increase their yield per acre. It has helped the farmers to grow bumper 
crops by using chemical fertilizer a few out of these west variety varieties of the contributions are good quality seeds better variation of crops pesticides more milks producing and processing and the and the preservation of food the farmers with the help of modern technology are now able to produce vegetables and fruit out of season technology and society have all together changed the standard of living man's standard of living has been uplifted to the great extent he is enjoying the comfort or luxuries of life these benefits and comforts include comfortable and air conditioned houses hot and cold waters gases electricity speed cars televisions refrigerators and many others man has changed his environment the world has now become